Welcome back to Piers Morgan Uncensored. Veganism, the art of eschewing all pleasure in life, is one of the 21st century's most bizarre trends from where I look at it. But there are green plant-based shoots of recovery. The new fashion is for high-profile vegans, including explorer Bear Grylls, to revealing they're detransitioning back to healthy, meaty diets. And so many chefs like John Mountain, who runs Fire Restaurant in Perth, Australia, is also leading the fight back. He's made global headlines this week after announcing, sadly, all vegans are banned from fire for mental health reasons. We thank you for your understanding. Many didn't understand. He's been flooded with fake bookings and hostile reviews. But I'm joined now by the vegan ban himself, John Mountain, and here in the studio, animal rights activist Joey Carbstrong. Well, welcome to both of you. OK, John Mountain, why did you ban vegans from your restaurant? Uh, morning, Piers. Uh, I banned them from my restaurant because, look, I've been a chef for nearly 30 years, but on this particular incident, it was just too much. You know, they grouped together, which, you know, I'm very proud of the vegans for all sticking together, but they did. They grouped and banded together and then started hammering my business with one-star reviews. I saw my rating drop from a sensible 4.2 down to 2.8. They, they nearly broke me. God bless the vegans, though. It didn't and what, work. What was the incident that provoked all this? The problem that happened was a girl had uh, emailed me three weeks before uh, requesting a, a vegan selection. I, and I said, well, look, rather than saying that, what is it that you like? Tell me what you like. And she said, well, you know, I like gnocchi and risotto. I thought, OK, no problem. We change our menu every day, Piers, so it's not an issue. The problem was on the day that she did turn up, I, I couldn't do it. I, I let her down and it was a justifiable complaint. And she went nuts. But, yeah, slightly nuts, as I mean, they vegans, do. The, my thing about vegans is they tend to be, I don't know, they seem to me permanently hangry. Like, the lack of meat in their diet makes them very intolerant <laughs> of people and they get very agitated. And if you don't sign up to all things vegan in the way that they want you to, all hell breaks loose. I think that seems to be the issue, um, Piers, to be honest. I think they're just missing a really good burger or a glass of milk, you know, or both. Uh, you know, they need to sleep more, be a bit more healthy. Although, you know, the vegan diet allegedly is healthy, just not for everybody else, you know. I think each to their own is 100%. Okay, well, I want to... OK, let's come to Joey. So, Joey, Bear Grylls, who I know well, said he's embarrassed he used to promote veganism. Uh, he now eats a diet of red meat, blood, bone marrow, as well as salted butter, eggs, fruit and honey. He says he's never felt better. Talking about his transition to a vegan diet, he said, I was vegan quite a few years ago. In fact, I wrote a vegan cookbook. I now feel a bit embarrassed about that because I promoted it. I thought that was good for the environment. I thought it was good for my health. And through time and experience and knowledge and study, I realised I was wrong on both. He's embarrassed to, that he promoted a plant-based diet when he drinks urine and bile out of uh, camel's stomach. Urine's quite healthy, though. It's healthy? Would you drink urine? Would you rather drink urine? Absolutely, if I had to, yeah. If I was in the yeah, but he, he's, if he, he's embarrassed that he uh, now... that he uh, promoted a vegan diet and he's not embarrassed of his behaviour on TV and he thinks that eating the bodies of animals... Why are vegans uh, so angry? <clears throat> well, um, he, he made a statement saying uh, the vegans are hangry and angry, but he carried on and banned all vegans from his restaurant because of one simple complaint. He's allowed a, to? Yeah, he's allowed to ban a whole group of people from Well, he's a chef who's just sick of tailoring to vegan well, people who want to have all this stuff and get angry about meat. Well, listen, 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 wait a second. He he got a two uh, he got a two star review when he was on um, Great British Menu, right? He ripped off his mic, smashed up the studio, and said that he wanted to kill the guy for giving him a two star review of a fish dish that he made. He didn't ban all fish eaters <laughs> from his restaurant. Why not? You were right? you were didn't ban all Why fish not? eaters. Joey, Joey, so, Joey, we're gonna get, go, Joey, listen. we're going to get personal. You were a gang member, so don't take the high moral ground of um, smashing something no, up. Am I, am I, I'm completely honest about. True. It. There's been documentaries made. Right, about so don't take the high moral ground about losing your temper. You were literally in a gang. I was 10 years ago, 10 years sober now. You're going to use I'm that. I'm just saying, if you're uh, going to get personal with him... But anyways, I don't walk around with uh, dead baby pigs facing them like that. Like, does that look like someone oh, who really a gives a damn about animals? Picture. Like, you know, and he, that's, he, he, that, that's his profile picture. Looking at a dead pig... Correct. In Joey, Austra Joey, in Australia, one you. second, I just want to say Joey, this. In me... Australia, pigs are killed in gas chambers, OK? They right. cause pigs... They're, they're horrible. Have you seen footage from inside a gas chamber? Joey, here's the thing... I recently that's... exposed one in the UK. Yeah. They scream to death and beg for mercy. In Perth, there's a gas chamber called Lindley Valley Pork, right? And this guy serves pork 
support his restaurants. All right. And why would you be more Joey? upset that, of a little complaint as a chef than pigs being murdered let in Gaza? OK, let me ask you the question that I asked a vegan activist the other day, okay. which is that given that 80% uh, or 90% of the world's almonds come from California, where they are made in the involving the demolition of billions of bees who get murdered. How do you feel about the little guys? They don't guys? get murdered. Um, that's completely false, and I don't know why... How many billions, how many me, billions of bees die in, in the pollination? I've of, got the 2022 data right on, here. Then. They die mostly from parasites and pests. 66% die mm. of uh, varroa mites or other pests and parasites. But Some in the making, disease. In the making Excuse me, of no, almonds no. and avocados. <laughs> they don't. Oh, they do. <laughs> they do. What, the data you know, is here. It's this here. Do you know where I read this? This here is data from US Department of Agriculture. Do you know where I read this? Wait, I read it in The Guardian, the vegan bio. Bible. Even the Guardian <laughs> admitted me. that this you vegans who eat avocados Only and almonds. Six point seven percent. This is not. You don't and care also, about the little guys. We boycott. Billions of bees get those, murdered, and bees, you don't care. Where do those bees come from? Huh? Where do those bees? In come America, from? they come from all over where? the country. The commercial honey industry. That's true. And, and a lot what, of them what do. do. We boycott? What do vegans boycott? Go on. The, the commercial honey industry. Why don't you boycott almonds and avocados? Because. I don't see a reason to. Most of the bees are dying from mites. Do you see pollination? You don't see a reason to. Bees? Okay. All right. Listen. So you don't six, care about the little only guys. Only 6% die from pesticides, so it's not a really a rights violation. They're not murdering the bees. Joey, it is here's dying. my point. The bees big are just, pig. No, big pig. One bees. second. A big pig makes you cry. A they little bee. Killed in gas you don't, you don't care. No, listen. You don't care do, about. There's a, no reason bit, to be upset about pollination. Sometimes 50 they die from mites. Why aren't you angry at the mites? Hang on, Joey. Barrel of mites. Sort of shout over each other. Sometimes 50 billion bees die in six from weeks. From mites. To give you vegans. I've literally just your told you they die from mites. Check no, out the, that's uh, not true. That agricultural stats that is from not America. true. Read and the Guardian. Read the Guardian. I, I read it in an article. Let like me an anecdote, so it must be true. Listen. Joey, how long have you been a vegan? Uh, ten years. Right. Do you actually? Because you seem quite agitated to me. Like you want a I bit just of. Just about nonsense about bees being murdered when they die from mites. They are murdered. <laughs> They're murdered. <laughs> you're a, it's it's clown think, behaviour. But, Listen. You, but do you think, in a way, you represent what I feel about vegans? That you're all no, quite hangry. You, are you against animal cruelty, Piers? Yes. Then why do you support animal cruelty when you support the meat industry? I don't. Industry? I've defended the bees for years. No, well, they're, yeah. they're not murdered. They die from oh, mites. Billions of bees are murdered we, so that you, you vegans honey? can eat almonds and avocados. Do you honey where, they, where they're hired, hired from? John, let me, let me bring in John here. Uh, yeah. John, look, here's my point about the vegans. There's a lot of hypocrisy, as there is with all these debates, right? Which is that... If you want to eat almonds and avocados as a vegan, you feel virtuous, you think you're saving the planet as well. Actually, neither of those things are true. Billions of bees get killed to make almonds and avocados. People can go read the, 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 the proper reports about this. Yeah. Uh, and also, they fly the men around the world or they truck them around the world and, of course, that is terrible for, for, the, for the planet. They truck animal products around the world. Do you believe, John, that there's a kind of basic hypocrisy here with the vegans? Look, I, I, I think, Piers, what I've noticed is that there's, there's a, a strange correlation that they have between um, eating meat and death and murder, which they like to keep promoting that murder aside. I think if they look at the definition of murder, you know, this is human versus human, uh, and that is it. You know, look, I'm 100% against animal cruelty, and for him to <laughs> bring up the great British menu, well, it just shows his mentality, you know, Good lad, congratulations, well done. It's not what we're about. I think each should be to their own and you should just enjoy your life. You know, if, yeah. if they're going to argue, yeah. Piers, why I you feel that they should enjoy your life. Well, but, Joey, why oh can't you... Why are you killing animals? Look at this. Joey, it's Posing a pig. with a murdered piglet. It's a pig. It's a pig. It's a pig. Yeah. Posing with That's a murdered piglet. And, and it Joey. wasn't just... You can't handle a simple complaint from a... And this woman, she's a very nice but Joe, but Joey, I spoke to this young woman. Yeah. She's very nice, very kind, very polite. And yeah. you can't handle a simple complaint... Joey, let me ask you a question. A celebrity chef. Joey. And it's clear... Joey. Even meat eaters complain about <laughs> his restaurant. He doesn't ban all meat Joey, if you, want to be, if you want to be a vegan, I don't care, right? It's entirely down to you. If you without bees being slaughtered? They're not being slaughtered. Billions of bees... Everyone go Billions and Google. Billions of bees are getting killed okay. by mites. Here's what, here's what I say. To everyone, to everyone watching this, either on the show tonight or on YouTube later, go and Google bees... US Department bees, of Agriculture staff. Bees, almonds, right here. avocados, yeah. and you'll see the truth. Um, the truth. Even on. The Guardian, where they all are compelled to eat lentils every day when they wear their sandals to work... This is a gas chamber piece. This is how pigs are killed and slaughtered in the UK. This is my is, investigation. Why, right. you a question? why don't Watch you play it. me? Why don't you play me the sound of billions of bees being murdered? Well, I know that animals get killed so I can eat pigs. They're screaming to death. 
Right. Look at them, face them. What do you think bees do? Face them, they're What do you think them. bees do when you murder them? They're, they get killed by mice. This is gas huh? chamber, look at it. No, no, no. You they don't get, even want to look at it. They get coward. slaughtered. You're a coward. I'm not cowardly. Look at it. I know that animals get They're slaughtered murdered. so that I can eat animal yeah. meat. I've stuck this camera in this gas chamber in the UK at Pilgrim's Pride mm. and they scream for their lives and every single animal welfare uh, but here's my problem. against Here's them. my problem. And you uh, eat bacon and you promote it. I love bacon. You promote it. You I love promote, bacon. You, you say you're against animal I love cruelty. sausages. <laughs> I love it all. I love eating meat. You love animal cruelty. Yeah, I'm prepared yeah. to admit I love eating meat. You're not prepared to denounce avocado and because almond Because you're making up stats. Like, they, they don't get Because slaughtered. they actually lead to the extermination of they millions of bees. bees Final word to John. John, is there anything that will persuade your mind to let vegans in? Because obviously he'd be a fantastic Sorry, guest in your restaurant. It's just discrimination, isn't it? Thank yeah. you, Piers. Discriminating I against I the whole group I didn't of people. Hear you then. It's just absolute childish, childish behaviour, discriminating against the whole group of people because of a one little silly complaint. Go ahead. Joey, when, was, Joey, when was the last time Danny. you laughed? Last time I laughed? Can when I heard you say that all bees are slaughtered because of avocados. It's an absolute abject it's lie. An ab it's an it's absolute a lie. fact. You, and you can't, facts don't it's care about your feelings, Piers. Can I get a word Facts don't right. care about Yeah, John, final word to you. Final word is how many vegans does it take to change a light bulb? Go on. None. They all oh, prefer to stay yeah. in the dark. Well, wait for the punchline. What's the punchline? Yeah, None what? Yeah, yeah. Go have a cry made they out of complaint. They all prefer to stay in the dark. <laughs> Go have a cry. Actually, the other complaint. one I like is that how do you know when someone's vegan? Don't I'll worry. See gas chamber footage. Don't worry. The UK. They'll they soon tell you and play uh, pictures and stuff of people screaming. Of pigs being murdered in gas What they won't play you is bees being well, murdered. Joey, uh, Joey great brilliant. to see you. Bless John, you, thank you for He's joining brilliant. me from Perth. I Go appreciate vegan, it. Go vegan, Pierce.